All right, so I've been a little bit busy between uh, between clips here. <laughs> Seriously. I just taped up a Jerboa over here, and I look over, and I'm like, what the hell? And then the tail moved, and I was like, oh, God, the butt. Kind of pairs are stuck in a tower. You know what? Let's go ahead and... Hey, buddy. <laughs> you okay in here? Oh, uh, the gigantic rhino butt poking out of the wall there. But I did go ahead and get a a, a bit of a. Ooh, breeding operation set up over here. Uh, I've got a male and female gotcha. I've got my two Denonicas, and... I just recently got myself a couple of, you know, high level rock drakes. 570 and a 555. All right, and let's see. Behavior, enable wandering. That way they'll keep breeding whenever I'm not in the area, which is a good thing. And that's what these guys are all set to. And uh, so far, uh, we've gotten four baby gotchas. We've gotten quite a few Denonicus eggs too, actually. Yeah. I've basically just been recycling random stuff that I've been finding in the area and uh, anything she drops that I don't want to keep, which has so far been everything. Oh, that's right. You can't put them berries or narco berries in here. All right. And uh, for the gotchas so far, we've actually gotten kind of lucky. We got sap, black pearl, obsidian, and another red sap, which is what mom is there so and I guess I could start up some Jerboa breeding too because why not right if we can get some mutations stacked up on Jerboas and there we go Okay, currently mating. Awesome. All right, let me let me buy. Eh, yeah, they take their time. Not a problem. Now, did you have any other crystals around here? The crystals kind of sometimes will sink halfway into the ground here. Also, Z fighting here is a bit much. Ah, uh, like the ground flickers as you walk because the textures are. Slightly overlapping. You can tell, like, if you just move the camera. Yeah, it's... Two textures fighting for the same location. But all in all, I mean, besides the ground, like, tweaking out, it's actually a really good place for a base. Went ahead, I got a, a reinforced dino gate at every entrance. And I just put some wooden spikes next to it, because, well, I, I had the materials on hand for that, so... It's much easier to try to get the foundations to line up and everything like that. I might make these look better in the future, but for now, that'll keep things out of here. And I've been leaving my Herrera sword over here. And while well, it's on uh, attack my target, I think. Yeah. Let's just go ahead and put it on neutral. If anything sneaks in here and starts attacking my guys, since they're on a hitching post, they can't fight back. That's why I have a Herrera sword. You should be able to take care of anything that in the area that'll want to attack these guys. I think the worst would be probably a Thyla or a Thorny Dragon, really. Either one would cause quite a bit of damage. But uh, so I tamed up the Rock Drakes, and the second one actually gave me 
the uh, the glide wings I was looking for. I love how they look. So, Oops, see if I can get to stand still. Uh, the problem is, is it shares colors with your shirt, and I can't change the orange because that's on region two. And desert cloth armor does not have anything on region two. So there's, yeah, unfortunately not much can be done about that. Oh, man, that dungeon in the area. I'm looking to see if there's any more, like, female Draboas around. And... Yeah, I haven't really seen any. Well, I finally saw that one, but... Rhino butt. And let's see, do I have my wyvern on me? I do, okay. I was trying something out with her at base and I couldn't remember if I picked her back up afterwards or not. Well, we've got a lot of camels around here. There doesn't really seem to be anything dangerous in the area though. Oh, that's a 290. And I kind of doubt I'm going to be doing a, uh, you know, like a camel train across the desert. So I don't think I'm going to need more than maybe just the one I've got. Although it could be kind of cool to set that up. Be extremely hazardous too. But that's an idea, actually. That is an idea. Oh, hey, it's a Segnosaur. Ah, eh, level 100. Yeah, I'll pass. There you go. Okay, so 11% off of a berry bag. I'm using these because it literally takes one to tame up a Draboa. So I didn't see any point in bringing better veggie baits around because, well, it'd be a waste. Of course, I wasn't planning on taming anything else but Draboas. All right, what are you running from? I'm used to having my whip there. All right, see so yeah, we don't really get anything special out of the yuccas. Okay. Oh, let me up. There we go. And that was wonderful. Nope. Okay. I was trying to get up a little higher to see if I could maybe spot what that camel was running from, but might have been the data on. Very well could have been the data on. All right. Well, uh, we'll give the data on a bit of a wide berth. It's not attacking anything, so it's not hungry, but, uh, I don't want it to suddenly become hungry while I'm next to it. Or, well, within aggro range. They will become angry if you get too close to them. But, uh, that's, you know, different than being actually hungry. And, yeah, I'm not really seeing any other, uh, little Draboas around here. Hmm. Oh, well. Right, I did some work back on the uh, Titanosaur as well. Actually, you know what? Let's try an experiment here. Okay. Uh oh, I want that. That was the thing. Oh, I love Cryptops. The hell? Killed something and it glitched out hard enough that it, yeah, was warping around. So. Oh, thank you. Uh, problem. I've only got one carnivore bait on me. Also, I didn't re realize cryptops were going to be an issue up here, so it's a bit unfortunate. Oh, hey, cool. And 
Oh, just the one? Alright. Yeah, I know. I'm not really feeding you high quality crap here, so. Alright, so let's try the experiment with the uh, the Titanosaur first. Also, you're level 30. Oh, drops back. Oh, it's blue this time. Yeah, it seems to cycle between green, yellow, and blue. Alright. Come on over your hat this way. And... Level 100 Raptor? Okay. I think I just killed a jug bug, so... Should be good for a while. Got floating rocks. Oh. No, 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 no. It's attacking the dodec. We're okay. At least until the dodec balls up and then, you know, I don't want to be the closest thing to that raptor. So right click. Uh, let's grab ourselves Citadel. Can I get up? Thank you. Hey, and it teleported the structure on the back without a problem. Cool. This is what I've managed to put together so far. And, uh... I'm not sure exactly what the rest of it's going to look like. Uh, here, we actually have to have access to the saddle for, you know, obvious reasons, right? Uh, but up top there is actually the perfect size to fit a uh, crystal wyvern. So, see, left click is... Okay, and right click to stomp. He does nothing. Okay. I don't even think you can harvest anything, can you? Nope. Okay. Oh. I feel a little bit bad about that when I stepped on him. Oh, hell. Well, he's not hungry. So, yeah, my... The Tennisaur has levels. You cannot level anything. Also, it's only lost five points of food so far. I do have a uh, raid dino feeding in uh, turned on. Where did that raptor go? the things on the ground. I know I'm going to squish like a Draboa or something. Oh, there's a Sabertooth down there. Oh, and the windows there so I can actually do first person. Brightly colored relatops, isn't it? Dang it. Off of the tree. Is that an actual tire wolf? Oh, yeah, it is. It just looked a little funny at first. Yeah, this is some, uh, that's like Dayglow right there. All right, well. Oh, 
Oh, that Morello tops ran right through without me actually stepping on it again. I think I stepped on it once, though. But, uh, unfortunately, the wolf didn't make it, so. When did I start passive taming that thing over there? Oh, that's the one I threw the berry bag to. Oh, God. I'm an idiot. Oh, God. When he pooped, he shook off my grapple. <laughs> Just all of a sudden, I was falling. Okay, where did that camel go now? Not that, this. Here we go. Twenty two point six percent, huh? Okay, good. I wonder if I stepped on a snake by accident. It was already somewhat injured. Oh god, we got Coelophysis over here. 270 and a 90. And this camel I'm trying to tame up has just walked right over here. Hey, come here. One seventy, yeah. Those things attack, I I'm dead. Camel's dead. Everything's dead. Ready to show up. And a 100. Hmm. Far enough away that it's counting as a separate, a separate pack. Okay. Yeah. Okay, cool. Now I can feed by hand anyway. The plus. Okay, may start following me. Now's a good time to start. Perfectly honest. I think it was following me there for a second, but. And now it's not. Oh. All right, well, we're getting a bit further away, which is good. Yes, I know. You're talking up a storm on my shoulder there. Man, these things tame up quick. Wow, look at the health on that guy. <laughs> Come on, quit walking towards this the little predators. Would you just get hungry again? Oh, just decide you want to get cared for. That would help quite a bit too. All right, 
one more feed and you're done and we can go. God, you are leggy, aren't you? Yep, there he goes. He wants care. Okay. Okay. It's stemberries. I need to look up and see if there's like a saddle crafting bench or something for Marnie's. No, quit walking that way. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. Come on. Let's move. No venom, huh? Dang. All right. Ah. Hit me. <laughs> oh, I've got the best bodyguard in the world right now. Well, the camel does 200. And Citadel, you are damn near useless here. There we go. Oh, dude, it, it's good. It's dead. It's dead. All right. Did it have water? It does. Oh, okay. Uh, let's see. So what are your stats like? Oh, 1,000 weight. Okay. 3,000 health. I need to take a little bit of a beating from that day it on. It does have a saddle slot. Okay, cool. One thing I was curious about. All right. Well, I'm going to leave uh, Citadel out here for now. Oh. Stinker causes frame issues when I look at him. So. Uh, I love this lighting glitch too. It's so odd. Hey, works great. Dark as hell. Alright. Eh, sure, why not? Here. Wow, almost teamed it up in one go. Eighty-six percent, that's not bad. There's another Lystro over there, level forty Lystro. Male female. Oh well. I also have a mate boosted pair over here. And I don't know if he tamed up here in a moment. I don't think I'm close enough to get the notification, though. All right, so do we get rock drake eggs yet? Oh, well, we've got crystals. Oh, we got one special one, too. Primitive one. Okay. All right, so yeah, we've gotten three rock drake eggs so far. We got two Draboas. We got a weight mutation on a female. Wow. Really? Parachute blueprint. And the primitive one was. Wow. Okay. You know what? You can just have those. I don't feel like taking them back. All right, so I think there's one new gotcha in here. Yeah, that no, that's sap. Black pearl, obsidian, 
That one. What do you make? Uh, organic polymer. Okay. I think there's 23 specialized resources they can make. And we've got like five or six of them so far total. All right, was it up this? No, I think it was uh. Okay. Every side like looks the same around here. Where are those lystras at? Here we go. You and you. Come on, little grumblers. They they really do grumble quite a bit. Almost like they're saying, I'm fat and slow. Quit making me run so much. They're trying, though. <laughs> they are trying. Yeah, I need to make more ammo. All right, so what are your stats like anyway? Uh, just about 16,000 health. 1100 weight, 792 melee. Okay. Uh, 18,500, 1200 weight, 840 melee. Wow. Yeah, you outshine your partner in every way, don't you? It's only like, what, a 15 level difference? Yeah, only 15 levels and... Damn it, that's not a difference. Alright, what did you give me? Alt. Okay. But I think I'm going to go ahead and call this an episode. I uh, might do some more work on this between episodes. I'm not sure yet. But uh, one of these times soon, we need to do that cave here. I think between episodes, though, I am going to go de uh, taming some Dimetrodon to bring over here. Do that or air conditioning. Yeah, the wind power is not the greatest on this map. So I have to work with something else. Well, it's still sparking, but there's no power to it, so. But who knows? But thank you for coming out. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Until the next one, the sign signing out. Have fun.